like to talk about a magical little um, add-on add program to Zotero called Zotfile. And its purpose is to help you organize your notes from your PDFs. And it actually will, we can copy our notes and bring them into a note in um, in Zotero. So for example, here's a paper we have, and it has a note, that's a note, and in that note I've written a paragraph, and uh, but this, I would like to add another note. So I'm going to go into the uh, the paper, and I'm going to, as I was reading the paper, this is an interesting journal. It's a Spanish journal. Notice they have the abstract, and they put in the references, and then they start the introduction. So there are no references at the end. But anyway, I've read through this article, and I've highlighted some things that I think are important. And I save it. And after it's important, after you have highlighted your notes, it's very important that you save it. Um, and actually, I didn't change anything, so I don't really need to save this one. But I've already saved it. But that way, it goes in the same storage location as, uh, as it was. You're not duplicating it. And you want to replace the one that's currently there with your new PDF file that has these highlights in it. Because what we want to do is we want to go collect those. And how do we do that? Well, let's go back to our um, file. And let's manage our attachments. Let's extract annotations. And it is doing that. It's still thinking. All right. Now it has extracted the annotations that are in the pediatric file. And here they are. And so these are the highlighted things from my uh, paper. Now notice in here I highlighted about a figure five. Shows the spectral radiance and transmittance of things. So I can do... Um, I can go in there, and I'm hoping this will work. Hmm. No, huh? Okay. Well, what you can do after you've got these notes, you can go into Word. I kind of like for you to do this for your articles. You start, you go into Word, and you start a new um, nope, that's not it. Word go in, file, new, and you go into Zotero, and let's make that smaller. You can drag that note into your Word document. And if we do this, then I'll be able to see, get some of the highlights and the information that you found important from the article that you read to answer your question. So um, that that's basically uh, Zotfile.
and it's a pretty slick program to be able to do that consolidate your notes now it's important that you don't write your paper based on rearranging these paragraphs that would be called plagiarism and you don't want to do that get kicked out of school lose your career very sad um, okay so uh, what you want to do is put the thoughts into your own words and then reference that you got the information from various articles okay uh, one more thing I want to just briefly describe is how do you download Zotfile it's not on the Zotero site that I saw so you would just Google Zotfile and this Zotfile advanced PDF notice the Zotfile.com so you don't get sucked into some other kind of thing you click on it and then uh, you can download um, this is by just a guy who's written this program you can donate to him which by the way I did just because I thought it was a pretty cool program and I wanted to support him so um, you can download that and then um, you can go to how to install and set it up and so it's not too bad you know once you've downloaded it you'll go into Zotero and tool add-ons tools for add-ons and then you can install it from there it's a uh, it's a pretty slick program. I hope you enjoy it.